Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. So, um, as promised, I'm going to show you my guys my McKay's haul tonight. Um, if you watched my last video, you kind of saw what McKay's was. Um, I did pick up some stuff from there that I didn't show you guys. Um, the two cars that I did, I'll, I'll show you guys those again. Um, but first, uh, I picked up something from weird from Target on that same day, um, which was... Uh, which was yesterday. Um, yeah, I picked up something weird. Um, a little different. Uh, so, I guess somebody returned this guy. It's got a little pinhole there. Pretty sure it was on display on somebody's, you know, wall or, you know, something in their uh, collection. Definitely a, definitely a little nail hole in it. Um, so, yeah. Copyright 2012. It's got a... An international card on the back uh, but it has a uh, Japanese retail sticker on it it's pretty cool never seen one of those in person before glad to have it um, definitely gonna be one for the carded collection won't be opening that one um, so the other two that I grabbed up from McKay's that one's from Target by the way not from McKay's but the uh, the two carded cards I grabbed were the uh, 2013 Hot Wheels Chevy Camaro Special Edition. You see, I paid a buck ninety-five for that, and uh, the reason I paid a buck ninety-five for that is um, just just go look at the price online on that on that car. Um, I really like the color of it. I haven't seen one in person before. I uh, really wasn't collecting that crazy, and uh, you know, 2013. It's new for 2013 model. Um, wasn't collecting that hard, but uh, yeah, I grabbed it anyway. Um, this one's also from, like, 2013-ish, um, Ferrari 458, 458 Italia, um, sorry, I got a little tongue, tongue, uh, tongue tied there, uh, <laughs> sorry guys, um, but yeah, so, um, Ferrari, I dig Ferrari, so, um, definitely gonna be keeping that one in the card also, just for display, card is actually not too bad on that one, a couple little bends on it, but yeah, to be expected when you're buying from like a thrift store type type place. Um, yeah, Ferraris. Ferraris are my thing. I definitely love Ferraris and Porsches. I I, I like supercars, you know, just like everybody else. But you know, Ferraris are definitely my thing. So let's get right to uh, let's get right to dumping this bag out. Picked up from McKay's. Alrighty. Pull the receipt out of there. So yeah, those are all uh, loose cars. That's pretty much what I, the, the majority of what I buy from McKay's. So this week is, um, you know, they were a little bit more expensive than the last video I showed. Um, that's the Matchbox Speed Shop. I believe it's a Ford Model A. Yep, Ford Model A. Matchbox Speed Shop. Busted out of the... Uh, plastic here take a little better look at it paid a buck 95 for that not too bad could be worse it's in pretty good shape it's a little dusty but uh definitely was sitting on somebody's shelf somewhere i just don't understand how mckay's gets these things um and i got i got a several few um uh, several cool vehicles from them this week that is a 25th anniversary. Um, you guys can see Hot Wheels Malaysia. Didn't tell me anything about the car. But uh, we'll just call it a, uh, a chrome Ford sedan. Because that's what it is. It uh, does have a bent up axle. But uh, I mean for a buck. Buck 95. Yeah, whatever. It's in pretty decent shape. I'll uh, definitely be putting this one up on a shelf somewhere. It's a cool car. I like it. Um, it gets me to my point. Definitely collect what you like. Uh, paid a buck for this guy, 95 cents. That's a 65 Ford Mustang convertible. And, uh, well, drop that one. Um, you know, guys, usually when you pick these up loose, yeah, the tampos are iffy on it. But, uh, you know, usually when you pick these up loose, they're missing the windshield, 
missing a you know missing a bunch of stuff usually pretty play worn which is you know fine but uh this one doesn't seem to have much play worn on it or play wearing on it at all uh, it's got a couple of chips on it but it's cool for a buck um you know i'll definitely shoot some pictures of that one for the instagram page oh uh, let's see what else we get here got a corvette Paid a buck for it also. I was getting 45 cent cars in the past. Um, they didn't have many 45 cent guys um, this time. So, tough luck for me, I guess. But, I remember having one of these when I was a kid. Had to buy it for the nostalgic purposes. And, uh, you know, along with Ferraris, Corvettes are one of my favorite, favorite cars. Um, this is a... It says it's a 19, uh, copyright Mattel 1988. It can't be much, much newer than that. I'm, I'm going to give it like 90s, early 90s, uh, judging by the wheels on it. Haven't looked any of them up really. Um, just like I said, just collecting what I like. Table's got a little slant on it there. Stuff starting to roll away. Picked this one up because I, I thought it was pretty neat. Again, for a buck, 95 cents. You guys see that? Pop that one open. It is a Real Riders Dodge Rampage. Still has the rubber tires on it. In pretty decent shape. What you'll see on these uh, Real Rider cars is the wheels will start chipping. Um, this one's got a little bit of play, play wear on it. But um, it's still cool. Tampos are war. Uh, may do a custom with this. Like I said, may start doing customs on the channel. Don't know. Still working on that idea. Um, but yeah, cool for a buck. Uh, they're not, this one's not worth much online. Maybe three to four dollars. Uh, so, you know, I picked it up for a dollar. It's neat. I love real rider cars. Um, so, my last two, last best two for the last, I guess, for the end. Um, picked this guy up for a dollar. 95 cents there. And it is a Ford van. I picked it up thinking, you know, that's that's a pretty cool model. I like vans, both in uh, you know diecast and real life. But um, I did a little bit of uh, eBay searching, and I was uh, pretty surprised with the results on that one. And uh, that one amazed me. So, uh, you guys can do your own research on that one, I won't tell you. I'm not purchasing the resale, I'm just purchasing as a, you know, collector. Um, so yeah, check that one out, it's a Ford van. It does have the, uh, Suzuki logo on it, if you guys do want to check it out on, online. Come on, camera, focus. There we go, Suzuki team. It is just not one to co cooperate. Uh, Suzuki team. Or Suzuki Racing Team, ATV, Goodyear, logos on it. Yeah, it's, uh, just check it out online. Check it out on eBay. See what, uh, see what you guys think. Um, so, this was my favorite piece. I don't know what it's worth, but I have definitely never seen one. Again, 95 cent purchase. Picked it up for under a buck. Um, it is a Greyhound bus. And it is made by a popular brand in everywhere else but the United States. It's a Tamika. I guess it's a Japanese brand. I don't know. I don't really know. Definitely has some uh, play wear on it. Um, still a cool still a cool casting. This is definitely going to go on a, a display shelf. Um, neatest thing that I saw there. Definitely had to have it. So, well, there you go, guys. That's this week's McKay's haul. If, uh, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up. Hit the bell. Stay in touch. Keep up with uh, new videos. Definitely, definitely leave some comments. You know, interact with me. Tell me what you want to see on the channel. If there's anything in particular that you want to see more of. Um, if there's anything you want me to showcase on my Instagram channel. But, um... Uh, Alright guys, have a good night. Appreciate you watching.